trio of departing crew members made their way through the small passageway connecting Rosviet with the Soyuz TMA 05M spacecraft uh, before the hatches uh, were finally closed. Uh, the crew members saying goodbye to one another uh, for the final time. On Saturday, it was Williams who handed over command of the International Space Station to Ford, who will remain Expedition 34 commander until mid-March, when Ford, uh, Novitsky, and Torelkin come home after five months in space. Uh, Ford, at that time, will hand over command of the International Space Station to Canadian Space Agency astronaut Chris Hadfield, who will become the first Canadian to command the International Space Station. Undocking confirmed. I see the confirmation for the SSVP mode and also the separation. I see the separation straight without rotating. Undocking occurring on time at 4.26 p.m. Central Time over northwestern China. The indicator mode has uh, disappeared. We copy. And the uh, RSC Energia personnel in this video replay uh, just after landing, uh, opening up the hatch with a ratchet tool and uh, reaching inside uh, to uh, shake the hand of Soyuz commander Yuri Malenchenko, who is in the center seat, and uh, pulling out uh, from Malenchenko uh, some of the flight data file books uh, that he used uh, during uh, the procedures uh, prior to and during uh, the Soyuz's return to Earth. Uh, getting those out of the way and putting them in bags to be returned uh, to Moscow, uh, enabling uh, Malenchenko to be extracted from the capsule. We should be seeing that uh, very shortly. And a good view of uh, Yuri Malenchenko being extracted from uh, the center seat in the uh, Soyuz spacecraft. Malenchenko completing his fifth flight into space on a total of 642 days in orbit placing him seventh on the all-time space endurance list. Sonny Williams uh, now uh, in this video replay being extracted uh, from the left seat as the board engineer from the Soyuz vehicle. Aki Hoshide uh, obviously uh, was the last to be extracted. Sunny Williams uh, wrapping up uh, her second flight into space and a total of 322 days in space on her two missions. She conducted three spacewalks uh, to emerge uh, as the all-time uh, leading female in terms of spacewalking time. Another view now of Yuri Malenchenko uh, with a whopping 642 days in space on his five flights, putting him seventh on the all-time endurance list behind six other Russian cosmonauts. And congratulations on the landing. Just say a few words. How was the landing? Everything was fine. We didn't have any problems. Uh, the timing and the landing site, everything was... Aki Hoshide of the uh, Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency completing uh, his second flight into space, a total of 141 days in space for Hoshide, placing him third amongst all-time uh, Japanese space travelers behind uh, Soichi Noguchi and Koichi Wakata, who will launch in uh, late 2017.
2013 ultimately to become the first Japanese commander of the International Space Station.